Well, you know, when I started with the FBI back in 1967, uh, of course, there was a lot of gunfire. Um, we shot thousands of rounds on the range, and basically, there was no ear protection. I think that's when my hearing loss started, and it was a gradual thing, and quite frankly, I didn't even realize I had a hearing loss until my lovely wife said to me one day, why do you always say what? Murphy, you're not, you're not getting what I'm saying. I was an old guy and aggressive, uh, set in my ways, um, and I just didn't think they were manly. Right after that, I was flying out on business with my co-pilot. With great trepidation, he comes up to me and he says, Mr. Murphy, you're not getting what I'm telling you over the inner, over the phones. You're not picking it up. And that's what I, that I said, I can't have this. I like everything about them. They're small. They're almost invisible. They are clear, precise. They're easy to take in and out. And you know what? For what they give you, they're dirt cheap. The return on investment is, is huge in my business. If I misunderstand a client, I'm in deep trouble. I have to be able to understand everything that client tells me and what that client wants. Now, if I come away from that meeting not knowing what that client wants, what am I to do? With, with, uh, with hearing aids, with the hearing aids, I hear everything clearly. I don't even know what type they are. And I really don't care. I love them, and even if I had to wear big ones now, I'd wear them.